we have been working in low earth orbit for a long time for which we have technology which is a material technology material shielding they call sometimes passive shielding also but then if you leave low earth orbit we don't have technology for that going to new territory of course you have to think of new new technology too the best strategy to avoid radiation is the one you can do and active shielding doesn't let the radiation go where you don't want it to go the same same charges repel each other you know so we place on the outer side the negative spheres and negative charges so the plasma is that way then we have another kind of set of spheres which are positively charged so positive charge also don't go through them and they bend around what we have done of course we have established the feasibility concept that it does work at the minimum it's 75% more effective so it is an enormous advantage we have validated in lab for negative charges which is plasma and then next step you know depending upon what funding we get of course we validate for uh, for uh, the ions also once we have validated then everything is done deal we have to optimize everything so gasmore structure is one of the things we have to optimize so they are folded when the spacecraft is launched and then they deploy you know when you go so the, the payload penalty is less the payload is the dictating factor you know of course if payload is not right if you don't get off the ground you are not business and gasmore has been successful and you know why not take advantage of that so we are here to take advantage of whatever exists uh, space radiation has been identified uh, by office of chief technologist one of the grand challenges so here we going to area that okay we know a lot of radiation is there which will be different of course but biological effects we don't know so we have to design some strategy you know it's such an exciting time for radiation